Well, that's right. The Rialto Police Department is releasing body camera video from an encounter that it had with four Airbnb guests. Now, this encounter happened back on April the 30th, and it involved some people that were removing luggage from the home. A neighbor called 911 after witnessing this and thinking it was a bit suspicious. Now, one of the guests was reggae icon Bob Marley's granddaughter, Denisha Prendergast. Her friend recorded Rialto police after they pulled over, after they were pulled over when a neighbor called 911 thinking that they might be burglars. They are accusing the police department of racial profiling following the incident. In a post on social media, one of the women said police surrounded them, then told them to put up their hands and informed them that a helicopter was tracking them. Rialto police, though, are pushing back, releasing their own video to show that their officers, in their words, acted respectfully, honestly, and professionally, even at times joking with all four in the vehicle. The entire counter lasted 22 minutes as police sorted out and confirmed that they had been guests in the home. The group had been in town for the Kaya, the Kaya Festival in San Bernardino and had rented rooms in the home over the weekend. During a press conference, we heard from the homeowner, Marie Rodriguez, who said that this could all have been avoided had her guest just used a bit of common courtesy. She walked over, smiled at him, and waved. And they basically looked at her like she was a Martian, like, who are you? And then later on in the tape, the officer explains, she waved hello to you, and you ignored her, and then they mock her. Oh, we ignored her. It's courtesy. Have some manners. We're all strangers until you say hello. This is not a racial issue. This has to do everything with building better partnerships with our visitors, our business communities, and we hope that our Airbnb would help us to achieve that. Now, according to the Rialto Police Department, they say that Prendergast and two others are planning on taking legal action with regard to the encounter with their officers. ABC News did reach out to Prendergast's uh, representation, their legal team, and we have not received a comment as of news time. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.